Welcome back to Rogue Trader. Keep See if we find some uh, some loot here in the beginning. Of some uh, motive force conductors, rare cloth dyes, mm, shards of crystalline crystallized darkness, and a multi key. Nice. Always keep your eye on the prize. Awareness ninety percent. Let's uh, <clears throat> let's save and see if we can do this. Huh? That wasn't so difficult. The corpses were mauled by a force far beyond any mortal capacity. The faces are twisted in pain. And their hands are fused with improvised weapons, tools, scissors, and cutlery. Uh, yeah, okay. Is there money to be made? Let's see if we can jump That's over how here. It's done. We could. Let's not sure. Not dawdle. The traps up ahead. Order your character to disable it. If a character enters a trapped area, he fails the test to disarm it. The trap will trigger, dealing damage uh, and inflicting injuries on all characters within its area of effects. Sometimes you'll see a trap marked with a red area containing the dotted line. The line leads to the mechanism that controls the trap. Ho hover your cursor over the mechanism. If the cursor changes to a trap icon, the trap can be disarmed by interacting with the mechanism. Left mouse button on the mechanism to attempt to disarm it. If you have the entire party selected, the character with the highest relevant skill score will go and disarm the trap. If a trap is marked with a red area with a dotted line, simply approach the trap and click on it to attempt to di the disarm test. Different skills are used to disarm different types of traps. <coughs> Kinda of tempted to go into combat with them. Oh, it's a peculiar thing. Just we as I go fly. back here. Oh, okay. Interesting. So I was supposed to go in here. I thought there was an extra area, but no. I think this is the way forward. See if we can disarm this. The Emperor favors me today. Sure. Sure he does. Stand firm, we must not let, let the miscreants defile the horse ha horse. House or cilio. <laughs> horse. Fire at will. For horse or cilio. <laughs> oh, that was kind of funny. That was kind of funny. So, Argenta. You definitely go up here. Well, you'll take up cover there. Abelard. And you first. Or not. But that's fine. <clears throat> She's gonna start. Let's see if we can... Um, can hit a few targets here, maybe. Fine. Double dodge, dude. Hmm. 
It's as good as done. Another enemy down. That 19 is pretty big. On it. Okay, so they can at least uh, friendly fire themselves as well. That's that's real good. For some reason, you can't see that. Can you... No. Not really. You can either get rid of that... I think we do this. <laughs> that lightning arc is real strong. Just gonna Tried and tested tactics of the go here directly, it and then uh, we'll um, use Endure. Okay. Unquestionable order. What does that do? My prescience has failed me. Oh, okay. It's an extra turn. Stop it! Oof. You're getting hurt pretty bad here. Two kills, I'll take that. It's gonna be pretty good. <laughs> I'm a man. Okay. Who if not me? Let's charge up. We never stood a chance. It's not a lot here that we can do. Rough. At least you missed that. We're gonna go back with her because I just want to chill before she gets some weird amount of damage. Six percent chance to hit. <laughs> that's um, it's not great. That is. It's 
real low as well. On all situations, honestly. I think we just take this shot. I don't need luck. I have strategy. <laughs> I don't need luck. I have strategy. I'll make it happen. Sure. Sure. Uh, we can probably rush here as well. Oh. Nice, he got hit for a zero. That's fine. We'll just stay there then. My place is at the fall. That pistol is real inaccurate. Victory is imminent. <laughs> well, one damage. Um, let's use run on the gun. I will bathe this battlefield in righteous fury. <laughs> nice, 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 nice. That's a good hit. I'll see to it personally. Another enemy down. Yep. Rue. Okay. Success is the only outcome I accept. Statue by the famous Calixian sculptor and chronicler Zacharias. Zacharias. Zacharias Vernon. The magnificent, the twenty-three year old, the twenty-third year of this millennium original. Interesting. There's some loot here. Data crypt. What's that? What the hell is that? Keep your wits about you. Black chest plate. I'm gonna have to go through these. Um... Pontius Cypheus Gelicius on the training of worthy servants at the court of the Navis Nobilite. Okay. I always Let's see if there's any more loot that we like. <clears throat> Intercepted conver conversation between security officers. The library is full of treatises by the most distinguished scholars of the Imperium, from Astra Militarum Tacticians to Adeptus Mechanicus uh, Genitors. Okay, yeah, let's go into the inventory here real quick. <clears throat> uh, mesh chest plate. Both of these are medium. This is 20% armor. Uh, dodge penalty is 0 0.75. This one is actually a bit better. Has 25% armor. And she also has a mesh breastplate. This last gun does a little less damage per shot.
So laser weapons are effective against targets in cover and targets with high dodge. Interesting. Let's take a look at this thing. A good major domo attempts to nurture only the finest of flowers in the garden that is their master's life. Therefore, new seeds for the garden must be weeded out with the utmost care so that the garden's trees may yield the sweetest fruit. The lessons below will help you to separate the precious seeds from the vile thorns to cultivate the perfect garden for any lady navigator. Lesson 1. A faithful servant always makes sure their mistress's rooms and garments are clean. Lesson 2. A faithful servant will never offer their mistress the same dress presented earlier in the cycle. Lesson 3. A faithful servant offers their mistress a glass of fresh water upon waking. Lesson 4. A faithful servant tastes each dish and every drink before serving it to their mistress. Lesson 5. A faithful servant will have mastered the art of styling their mistress's hair. The total time that five servants can spend on arranging their mistress coiffure should not exceed three revolutions of the chronometer. Lesson 6. A faithful servant lives for their mistress and gladly gives their life for her as well. And then there is nothing for seven, I guess. Let's take a look at the intercepted conversation between security officers. Tremendous honor, yes, but this promotion will transfer the entire squad to the child's personal guard. Why, the god emperor, well, you are strapping lad, you'll probably make it for a cycle or three. It has worn down better men than me. What even is the point if your brains turn into mush? I may rip out my eyes, like Amos did, at best. I'll just go bonkers like that little shit stain that kept stealing our... Uh, oh, what happened to that one? Threw himself out of a um, depressurized chamber because some voices told him to. Calm down. Keeper Felix said that the squad will never not have to serve the child for long. He even gave us a little leeway. Unlike that fish-eyed. Be quiet, he might hear you. Well, you know what I mean. He almost bursted our heads because someone forgot to check the catering unit. And there's something off about this place. I don't even know what this is. <coughs> Definitely don't know. Okay. I don't think... Um, yeah, I don't think we have much to offer in terms of weapons or otherwise. Always keep your eye well, on the price. Let's um, keep going here. There's definitely more loot up here. More armor, more things. Some scrappy auto pistols. We have goods. Okay. So, one of the things that I'm really wondering right now... Um, we're going to cargo management. What happens when these go over 100%? Like, oh, we're at 108% capacity. It doesn't say anything about what happens. It's just, it just goes over 100%. It's really weird. What do we have here? A meteorite chunk and some Ripper auto pistol. So this is three to five damage. It's a bit higher than the one I have. And it has 10% armor pun instead of five. 
I mean, I can make that. Actually. Mutated flesh sample. Is there money to be made? There might be money to be made. Let's examine this. Uh, damn it. Okay, I think we failed that, right? Yeah. Too bad. There's some loot down here as well. From this guard defender. Last gun and some more flak chest plates. Let's go into the door. There must be some way to unlock it somewhere else. Okay. Guess we go into this door then. This is intriguing. Oh. Yeah, but not intriguing in a good way. I better myself through my service. I always keep my options open. And here we have a navigator flesh sample. Some more things for the cargo cargo bay. Idira, stop castigating yourself. Your soothsayings have always been vague. Even if you had her, who among us would have realized that it was Lady Theodora who was in peril? Okay. Keep your wits about you. We have um barely good chance of clearing this debris. That's how it's done. Noble Silk Gloves. 5% bonus to Persuasion. That's, that's really nice. I'm gonna take those. Um, how much Persuasion do I have? 35. It's not even the highest persuasion. Or well, with this bonus it is, but uh, without I it it isn't. Plan. Okay, so we have two doors. Let's uh, let's take the left one first here. Spam saving as well. Rise to the top, or get left in the dust. See if we can open this door. <laughs> the premonition runs true. I always keep my options open. Let's uh, disarm this trap. Some valuables here. Take that. Save before we go into the next room. Let us not dawdle. Did you hear the screams? Move. Sir, are you all right? We can't hear anything. Oof. No, don't think this guy's all right. Now I see, you're in league with them. This is an insurrection. Yes, indeed. Death to the traitors. I don't know, dude. <clears throat> I know you're all traitors. Traitors, all of you. They told me. They whispered. Hey, who are you? I think I'm the guy that's about to kill you. Yep. Seems about right.
Keep your wits about I have no idea why the, what those data crypts are. It's a bit weird. Research notes of Navis Laboratorium. Custodian Fortunata Orcelio, part 13. Keeper Theobald graciously agreed to provide samples of his skin growths so we could study the influence of the rebellious immaterium on the flesh of the Navis Nobilite. Just as we thought, navigators are positively resistant to the relentless currents of the warp. The God Emperor truly does sh shield some people against corruption and misery. But let us get back to the study of mortal flesh. Another servant will be carried in shortly. I must uh, ready the organ extraction equipment. Adamantine dust and black water. This was the worst idea that could have entered my mind. God Emperor be praised. I am lucky to still have my head on my shoulders after this reckless experiment. Nevertheless, we did make an important discovery. The Admantine seems to protect the frail flesh of the lowborn to a degree. Having said that, not even the macerator can handle its temper. So we should probably introduce a more complex compound into the formula. All of the data related to this experiment will are recorded to DataCrypt K040H. I will get back to them later once I'm done with experiment H41OK. Is that the things that I got? We did get H41 OK and we got H40 KO. Uh, have I mentioned that the chunk of meteorite found by Keeper Felix subject is completely useless? Although its shining granules could be used to make new paints for the child. Yes, I think I'm gonna, going to do exactly that. Uh, yeah, I'm... Uh, definitely not liking this that much. Awaken the Cogitator Spirit. The Cogitator's vid screen is covered in cracks and stained with dried blood. The buttons, switches, and levers were ripped out of the control panel with exceptional cruelty and scattered around the sacred mechanism that now sparks and hisses in agony, still refusing to perish. Let's see if we can awaken it. You turn a few of the remaining dials and pull the activation lever. The cracked vid screen of the sacred engine flickers. The cogitator inside emits creaks and groans as the lumens oscillate at random. Um, it takes a while, but eventually the machine spirits do grant you access to the cogitator system. Um, let's see, request data on the station's navigators. After a brief pause, the data appears on the vid screen. Um, Felic, Felic or Celio, location main hall, status alive. Theobald or Celio, location upper chambers, status alive. Calomira or Celio, location upper chambers, deceased. Alexius or Celio, location lower levels, deceased. Um, Rasmus Estevan or Celio, location unknown, status deceased. The child, location upper chambers, biometric param parameters, rapid heartbeat, elevated body temperature, stress level exceeds the permissible limit, status unknown, error, attention. Calming procedures advised, attention. Upper chambers inaccessible, error, the control rod is not present. If the rod has been misplaced, immediately contact the station keeper or the Navis Laboratorium Custodian. Let's uh, take a look at the log here. The archive data stored on the cogitator's local data crypt is partially corrupted, but you still manage to access the residual logs for examination. Uh, let's see, view Vox report 12H, AH890. 
The Vox recording hisses for some time before you hear a voice. This is Officer 8282. Do you copy? Several generators overheated on the lower levels. Chambers A to D are unpowered. The tech priest crew sent to investigate the problem is not responding, requesting back. The officer's speech is interrupted by shouting and the recording abruptly ends. Officer H123 speaking. 200 servants have perished due to explo explosive decompression of the living quarters. We have located traces of mechanical interference. The preliminary cause is officer sabotage. Crews 5, 6, and 9 are cut off from the main compartment. We have enough, enough oxygen for 20 minutes. May the Emperor save our souls. Senior Station Officers, this is the Captain speaking. We have attempted to contact the Winter Scale Scion for help, but something is jamming the signal. We never received a reply and cannot be sure it was even sent in the first place. A rescue team is not coming. We are on our own, so remain vigilant. Anyone could be a traitor. You hear me? Anyone. If you are in doubt, shoot to kill. The following Vox recordings are too badly distorted to make out even a single word. Uh, let's take a look at the recent entries of the incident log. Report X880. Originator classified, date classified. The servants close to the child have started butchering one, <clears throat> one another again. An order came from above to have their remains reprocessed. Report X-886. Originator classified, date classified. The negotiations with the winter scales were a success. A new batch of servants will arrive in 10 moons. Escort them to the laboratory at once. It's imperative that we increase the new retainer's resistance to the child's powers. Report X-891. Originator classified, date classified, data expunged. Let's take a look at the docking log as well. The log is almost completely uh, corrupt, but you managed to recover the latest entry. Identity confirmed, Regent Ar Aronto Orsilio, date of visit classified. Reason for visit classified, date of depa departure classified. Security and life support logs. The yellow lights above the control panel flicker to life and the singular repeating message streams down the vid screen. Warning. Damage in technical compartments A12, B3, D8, and H24 detected. Warning. Living quarters L10, L16, L28 depressurized. Warning. Unable to access the station's docking system. Warning. Energy regulation system unknown error. The station will transfer over to emergency power. Immediate evacuation of the facility is advised. Uh, let's look at the encrypted data as well. Something buzzes in the cogitator's metallic gut. Several red lumens light up above the vid screen. Required access level, security captain or above. Current access level, uh, senior security officer. This is a 60% chance. Let's um, see what we can do here. I'm gonna save here in case something really terribly happens. Um, let's see if we can... How close was that? Okay, uh, well, we failed that. Um, let's see if we can call Rykad Minoris for help. The system cannot carry out your command despite the eagle compliance of the machine spirits. One thing is certain, the problem does not lie in the cogitator's mechanisms. Switch to the main chamber controls. The cogs within the sacred mechanism slowly starts turning with heavy grinding and clacking. The tired machine spirit grants you access to the station control, or at least its parts that still obey the cogitator. Let's see if we can open all doors. The cogitator's vid screen goes dark as if the machine spirit had fled their mechanical casket, but your assumption is incorrect, as it fills with static just a few moments later. 
You can barely make out an inscription amidst the flow of rapidly changing symbols. Warning, data cor corrupted, processing, processing, error, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Let's see if we can do this. The vid screen lights up with a smattering of unfamiliar green symbols, and you hear a peculiar click from somewhere behind you. It appears one of the doors in the chamber has opened. Okay, main elevator doors. Activate the elevator. Confirmed. Okay. One of the doors in the main chamber. I don't know what door that was. Was it this one? Oh, maybe we got some loot. The whispers told me how. Nice. It's a lot of loot in here, actually. Long last. I guess this is the um, equivalent of a sniper rifle. Does a lot of damage. And a carapace chest plate. That seems like good loot. And then more um, trading loot. Can we open this? There's a lot of servants here. Where's the child? Is she safe? For some reason, the arc enemy's twisted influence found its way into the station. You had his tongue cut off just like the rest of the lesser servants of House or Celio. The nice uh, house to be, to be made. be serving in, right? Um, okay. So if we compare these. I think this is a good upgrade for uh, for her. So she's going to use that. I don't know if she can use this. But um, I think she's the only one that has reasonable ballistic skills and can maybe hit with that. Has pretty... Has 18 range compared to 12. It's not insanely long, but it's pretty good. Rise um, to the top or get left in the dust. Let's take a look here. So we can rebuild this. The power to the elevator is restored. I always have a backup plan. The door is open. I think this door is open. Nice. I think that's the laboratory. Let us know, Doodle. Yeah, I think this is going to be it for this episode. Thanks for watching and uh, have a nice day.